powerful, effective, outcome-focused communication very much depends on being able to transmit images from your mind to the minds of your audience. And I work on this with clients when we're working on uh, doing great presentations with them, when we're working on short, sharp, punchy business introductions for them, and when we work on them with giving great answers to the tough questions that they face. So what I'd like to do here is to have a go at it, and to do so with the help of a great character in Africa. He's a giraffe, and he's called Jock. And even though it's a drizzly, overcast day here in London, I reckon you can probably picture where Jock lives on the giraffe sanctuary in sunny Kenya. The sanctuary is just outside the capital Nairobi and it's got very verdant green grassland and lots of jungle for the giraffes to uh, actually go through and look around and eat. But in particular, I'd like you to picture Jock because there's three things you need to know about Jock that make him stand out. One is he is particularly tall. Even by giraffe standards, Jock is a really big boy. Number two, because he's so big, Jock needs to eat a lot of food, so he's always very hungry. And number three, Jock is very friendly, and by being friendly, he gets lots of food from the tourists. So when you enter the giraffe sanctuary, the first thing you typically see is Jock and the giraffe viewing platform. It's a wooden structure, you can climb up on it, and on the structure is a bucket full of round yellow fluffy balls of stuff called giraffe food. And you put your hands in, and you hold them out, and Jock will come over, lower down his towering neck, you get to see his big brown eyes, which are really big, and he'll stick out his tongue, which is about that long, and blue and grey, and really slobbery. And he will slurp up all the giraffe food from your hands that you've got from the bucket, and come back and wait for you to get some more to feed him. So the question is, can you actually see Jock the Giraffe? Can you hear him slurping up the giraffe food from your hands? Can you feel how yucky and sticky your hands get when they're covered in giraffe slobber? But can you feel how magnificent it is to be near a creature who's so much bigger than you are and yet is so friendly and so gentle? So. When I'm working with clients, uh, we often do it inside companies, uh, with uh, teams, and we can do it in masterclasses, or we can work individually with people one-to-one. -one. What we do have in 2017 is an opportunity to come on the open sessions in London on the 18th of January, where you can come along and learn the technique yourself. We're doing two sessions on giving great answers to tough questions. In the first one of the day, before lunch, what we'll be doing is focusing on tough questions from prospects, from clients, from your own staff, uh, from officials or from uh, selection teams. And in the afternoon, we're focusing on great answers to tough media questions for when you need to do a media interview. So if you'd like any information about uh, uh, me coming to your company and doing things like that, or about the open day, then please email me at michael at michael.communications.com and I'll tell you everything you need to know. And I'm hoping you'll have a fantastically successful communication year in 2017. So start thinking now, what are those great images you want to transmit to your audiences? Happy New Year.